Our spotlight story tonight is about robotics club members at the Columbia Basin Tech Center who recently competed at the first robotics competition. Reporter Jeff Chu has the story. 28 and 4, 4, Robotics Club 4, 4, members 4, 4, at Columbia 4, 4, Basin Technical 4, Skills Center in Moses Lake are still pumped up about winning at the recent first robotics competition at Central Washington University's regionals. The arena-style event had rolling and lifting robots from different schools performing on two competing teams. Five robotics students competed on CB Tech's team with students from 34 schools participating. The rookie CB Tech team placed 22 out of 34 schools competing at CWU in Ellensburg. Engineering teacher Chris Whiteman, who oversees the robotics club at CB Tech and teaches 17 robotics students, explained how the competition worked. They were tested in how the robot performs and functions within a certain scenario setting and did pretty well. Uh, the robot broke down and unfortunately that was um, our biggest pitfalls were what breaking down in the competition, but they were tested upon how it would function within the group, how it could score, and durability, which ours didn't fare so well, in, but that's okay. Despite the typical breakdowns and mishaps, the CB Tech team's smaller robot was best at maneuverability. Moses Lake High School senior Joseph Friedbauer was the lead driver of the team's robot. Every round we seem to have a problem, so when you think pit crew, you know, quick fixes, that's what it was, the whole competition. I was standing back and crossing my fingers that I'd have the bot on the field for the next competition. And uh, every time, you know, my, my team would have that bot out there performing as best as they possibly could. The robot was best used to handily move pool noodles that littered the paths of the larger heavy lifting robots during a match. What you could do is use your bot to push that noodle into a scoring zone and instead of deducting points, it would actually earn points for your team. And um, the last match is on YouTube. Uh, we literally won that last match, the championship, by two points a litter. Just us pushing litter around, being janitor. Friedbauer hopes to continue studying robotics and competing at Eastern Washington University. He said he would return to CB Tech to act as a mentor for future robotics students. Friedbauer and others on the CB Tech team lamented that although the robotics team qualified for the upcoming state finals at Eastern Washington University in Cheney, the team could not afford the $4,000 entry fee. Moses Lake sophomore Will Turner looks forward to future robotics competitions on the CB Tech team. As assistant driver, he moved the CB Tech robot's scissor lift up and down. Turner's first year of robotics work has him seriously thinking about a career in the field. I love robotics, and then when I thought of this, I just, I really love the programming and creating in robotics. I've always loved engineering. The CB Tech team took home six trophies, including the 2015 winner and the highest rookie seed award. CB Tech, part cyborg. I'm Jeff Chu for iFiber One News. The captain, Shockwave, are your 2015 Central Washington University District Champions. We'll be right back after this.